Jim Harbaugh is back in the in the, in the uh, news. He basically said that camp um, is similar to uh, a woman giving birth coming out of the womb. What? Uh, that's what he said yesterday. Yes. Um, we're, but we're gonna bring up camp. Interesting reference to this. Um, his practice attire and everything else. You love you love Jim Harbaugh. He looks just like the like the camper. Like oh, he's camping. We got out. the video. I gotta hear this, JB. Right, go ahead, go ahead, just the way it feels. I mean. Feels like New Year's Day, you know? Feels like being born. Feels like coming out of the womb, you know? It's like you're in there, it's, it's comfortable and it's safe, and, uh, and now you're out, you're born, the lights are on, the, you know, it's bright, you got chaos, people, people looking at you, people, people talking at you, and um, uh, you know, just feels good to you know, have it happen. This homie, hey, Harbaugh has the all-time greatest memory of ever. He's the only person I know that re- has a vivid memory of his birth, of his concept, of him coming out his mother's womb. He remembers it. He said, the lights come on. Lights, camera, action. I got smacked on the ass. I started to cry. They, they, they pulled out my umbilical cord. They cut umbilical cord, clipped it. <laughs> Look at that. Hey, you gotta love it though. He's gonna always be himself. Right? You like I, that's the one thing I can respect about him. Hey, Steve, He's gonna be all, him. All jokes aside, this guy's a serious football coach. So, what does that make like the OTAs and the passing camps, Lamar's class? I, look, uh, I, I get what he's saying though. Every team is a new, uh, is, is basically a new thing. It's it's a new person yeah. every year. It's never the same, uh, and. Jim Harbaugh was once quoted as saying, I love football, but the reality is it's not always a fun game. There's a lot of toughness to it. There's a lot of pain. There's a lot of things you have to overcome. But he said that's what makes football great. And Jim Harbaugh, everywhere he has gone, uh, has been able to turn around programs very, very quickly. The job he did at Stanford to me is one of the greatest things I have ever seen. To turn around a winless program and to within three, four years have them beating USC consistently and having a top three team in his last season at Stanford, I'm a believer in him. I think he's going to have that team playing well. And unlike the previous coach, he's not going to lose them games. That was a big issue with the Brandon Staley-led Bolt. They lost games because of a direct result of coaching decisions. I don't believe that will happen under Harbaugh. Do you first see, I guess, is it it crazy to have an expectation to say the Chargers could win or could could compete for the division? Obviously, then AFC West with the Chiefs, but you got so much belief in Harbaugh. Is it crazy to believe that in year one? You know, when he came to the Niners in year one, they went to the NFC Championship game. And if it wasn't for a couple of, I think, a muff punt by Kyle Williams, they'd go to the Super Bowl probably. Or they they were right there. Look, he's got a, a... a thoroughbred at quarterback. They brought in both of his running backs uh, that played under the Roman system, right? Gus Doesn't Edwards, be- I believe. Yeah, Gus Edwards, and I think J.K. Dobbins. Yeah. I don't. I, their wide receiver situation is a little bit muddled. I don't like them getting rid of both guys, but I understand there was a money issue and an injury issue. <clears throat> but they're going to be very physical up front. They have two edge rushers. I don't know if one's going to be expendable or not, but those guys are future Hall of Famers. There's enough pieces, Darnell, that I'll say this. At the very least, they can be a playoff contender and a tough out 17 weeks in a row. You like them because of Herbert over the Raiders because of the unknown QB variable? Well, QBs matter. I I mean, if you flip QBs and you put Herbert on the Raiders, I'd be talking playoffs. Playoffs? Yeah, playoffs. You think there could be three playoff teams in the West? Well, the Chiefs are the constant. Denver's rebuilding, right? Yeah. Hmm. I say two because you got to think the AFC North might have three. Yeah. So, but I, I'm just saying the Chargers with the style of play that's going to be relatively unusual now because they're going to be a physical downhill team. And coach, you believe in Roman, right? Yeah, that's but, true. 